What's going on guys, it's Shane, we are back here again with another video. Today we're going to be returning to Roblox, checking out a game called School Bus Simulator Desert Ridge. Uh, you might recognize that name, this is owned by Project DVT2, uh, which is a revamp to the old Deer Valley Unified School District. Some of you guys might remember that. Uh, opened in 2019 and it closed in 2022. Uh, this group has quite a few games under it. It's got the one we're playing today, Desert Ridge. It's got Fairbanks, All Rank Edition, uh, Notaria Canyon. Hopefully I'm saying that right. I don't know. We'll check out these uh, maybe soon. I don't know. A lot of these I haven't played before. So if you guys want me to check them out, let me know. Uh, regardless, we're here today checking out desert ridge um general info here thank god we have free cam let's go um that's a plus uh if the speed limit is not visible oh no sorry if the speed limit is not obviously listed on any road assume that the speed limit is 25 okay when it over crossing turn hazards not use your red lights got it check out the office and i think the office is right next to us yes it is and then uh, they got all their uh, their fleet consists of 55 buses. Uh, you got some ERs, some FS65, HGX, C2, Minotaur, Bluebird, T3RE, and the Vision. Not all buses have been added. Got it. Got it. Okay. Uh, let's, what is this? Do not disturb the, gotcha. Gotcha. Won't do it. I'll respect your wishes. Um, here's the office. Oh, well, this is nice. Kind of, oh, this is detailed very nicely. Look at this. It almost is like a bank. I'm like a bank teller here. Not really. Okay. Uh, and then we have a restroom here. Um, oh, that's legit. See? <laughs> okay. That sign there. Uh, we got some cups here and all that good stuff. That's pretty cool. The office is really cool. Um, I like how it's kind of like a... What do you call these again? Like a, a portable building, essentially. Um, and then over here, what do we have here? This seems to be like a garage with some bay doors, possibly. Yes. Looks like an area to work on the buses. Oh, look at that. They open up. How cool is that? We'll just leave them open for the video. Anyway, here's our bus menu. You've seen this before, I believe. Yeah, we've seen this before. Okay. So they said they had 55 buses, but not all are actually implemented just yet. So... Uh, here are the wheelchair lift buses. I don't know if you guys want me to drive those or not. Spare buses, which contain a lot of older looking ones. Um, and then here's kind of the new ones, um, or somewhat new. Uh, let's spawn in a few just to kind of give you guys an idea of what they have. Let's spawn in the 2023 HDX. Okay, it's going to take some time here because my internet is garbage. So I do apologize. Uh, here we are. Now, I don't know what this is based out of. Desert Ridge. So it's still got the old Deer Valley Unified School District. That looks awesome. This actually, in fact, this HDX looks pretty cool. Um, got some storage compartments here. Make sure door is closed and latched. Oh, it's the NG powered. Nice. So it's not a diesel. Right? Yeah, no. That sounds pretty cool. Okay, so some things are still a little bit outdated, such as the gauges here. Uh, and what I mean by outdated is they still have like that blocky tachometer and speedometer needles there. Um, and then you have some cool little AC units here. And then the roof hatches as well. Uh, but we won't be driving this today. I actually have a bus in mind that I want to drive. Um... Let's despawn that. And then we'll check out the, let's check out one of the wheelchair lifts. Uh, let's do this one. Uh, this is not the bus we'll be driving now. Not the bus we'll be driving. So it's got like its own little section here, spare parking. And here's the wheelchair. Look at that. Ooh, even the light pops on. That's kind of cool. And then it kind of just pops down just like that. Nice. So, do we not have a license plate on here? I don't think we do. Uh, oh, I like that. Oh, it has the handicap sign there as well. Very cool. Let's see what the interior is looking like. Uh, okay. Pretty standard in here. Nice looking shifter. 
Spare nine. This bus parks at what? Air park lot. Okay. Fair park. Okay. I thought I said air park. Oh, this is nice. It's kind of very, it's very spacious in here. And you have the AC there. And then look at that. Awesome. Uh, we won't be driving that today either. So the bus we'll be driving is a spare bus. Um, and it's going to be the, uh, wait. Okay. Uh, let's just spawn in one of the T3 REs so you can guys, so you guys can look at that as well. I do apologize for not getting on the road a little sooner, but we do want to see the fleet, don't we? Yes, yes we do. Oh, this one looks cool with the storage compartments as well. Very nice. Okay, and then it's also have it also has these on here, which is very cool. Kind of set your own routes and stuff. Your route numbers. Uh, this is pretty standard as well. You guys have seen that before. Oh, I got some stickers in here. Eh, it's pretty. Oh, what is that latch back here? Oh, that's pretty cool. I've never seen uh, a T3RE on Roblox have this back window operation actually work. That's pretty cool. Okay. Uh, let's hop out of here. All right. Now, officially, the bus we'll be driving is a 2000. No, sorry. <laughs> it's going to be a 1998 MVPER. So that's what we're driving. Because I like the look of it. Uh, remember to do your child check. Okay. Cool. So here are some more spare spots, I guess. Yep. Uh, give it a minute to load in. And cut the engine compartment here. Actually, wait, no. Isn't the engine up front in this thing? No, it's in the back. Okay. Got confused for a second. And the door does work on this one as well. Yeah. Yes, it does. Cool. Is this open? No. All right. I like the MVP, ER, and EF. Those are some pretty cool buses. Okay. Even though they might not be very detailed on the inside, they are still pretty nice. Okay. All right. Ooh. I like the sound of the door. It's pretty cool. Okay. Now, I know I've never done a video on this game uh, because I would have remembered if I did. We have done a video on, I think it was actually just one of their games a long time ago. It's actually over two years ago, which is crazy. Because um, I think that was right around... 2021 maybe 2022 uh, it was before they closed i do know that uh it looks like they have another lot over there let's go and check that out so it actually looks like actually wait a minute i feel like i have done a video on this map before maybe uh, i don't know maybe not because I remember their old game had like, uh, it had like, instead of mountain, it was like barriers, I'm pretty sure, or like big old rocks or something. I could be wrong, but that's kind of what I remember. Uh, oh, wait a minute. They have a few lots here. Oh, an academy, you say. Oh, this is cool. It's got like their own little entrance here with their parking and... Desert Ridge Academy. Join the PTA meetings. Gotcha. We're just going to drive through here really quickly and see what this is all about. I do like the look of the roads. The roads look pretty nice. I think they have a, uh, a decal on them. Or is that standard concrete? I can't really tell. It doesn't look like standard concrete. I think there is a decal on the roads. Or texture. What have you. There's some benches there. 
that's not a bad looking school. That door is definitely oversized. <laughs> oh my goodness. I can already tell it's oversized. It's bigger than the bus, but that's okay. Oh, what do we have there? Back there, we have some like mobile homes, it looks like. What does that say? You you must yield to school buses. Okay. Gotcha. All right. Uh, I kind of want to go back there. And they have a nice little gate here as well. Now, like I said, I do plan to do more videos on their other games as well. I have to assume this might be their main game. I'm not 100% sure on that. Uh, I know the owner is going to be watching, so if you guys have any questions, uh, list them down below. Uh, also, their Discord and their group and the link to the game will all be in the description down below as well, because uh, it has just reopened, so I don't think everybody knows that just yet, so hopefully this video gives a little bit of insight to that. Uh, this is pretty cool. I like how they're all different colors. You don't normally see bright colors like this on, like, mobile homes actually you really don't see bright colors like that on any homes uh however i have before um but it actually does look pretty good in this game i still hate this default uh grass color that roblox implemented it looks so bad That's why anytime I start a game, I, I pretty much use my own materials now because Roblox did add some pretty cool ones like the, uh, as you can see there on the roof, they added uh, uh, roof shingles, which is pretty cool. Or not shingles, but the, uh, I guess you could call them shingles. That's what they call them. But uh, I think there's a proper name for those in particular. Shingles are more like uh, what you would find on an older or newer, depending on where you live. House, I don't know. I forget the official name for those. Those are the ones you kind of staple into the uh, the roof. Shingles you kind of just place on top of one another. But that area was pretty cool. What do they call it? Uh, Pananormia? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. So they have a train track here, which is pretty cool. And I'm not going to make it over. <laughs> I have to get some speed here. Could you imagine if buses had to do that in real life? That'd be so dangerous. So they have a lot of parks and stuff. It looks like. Look at this. Oh wow, a soccer field. We're gonna definitely turn down there. It looks like a kind of a recreational park. Yeah, sports complex. That's pretty cool. Not a lot of games have those. Which is something I actually want to implement in my game. Uh, I'm obviously going to have like schools that have like soccer fields and stuff. Baseball fields. I've actually yet to add those, but I do plan on adding them soon to my game. Uh, but I do want to make like a specific area buses can go to to drop people off. Such as a recreational park or something. This is pretty cool. So the... Oh wow, look at that. What's it say on there? can't read it scorpions okay cool that's a cool looking little field there looks like we have some more mobile homes we have some concrete barriers which is cool i like the addition of that i don't like it when roads kind of just lead to nowhere you know at least have some construction to kind of block it off
some of these other companies could take a tip or two. Okay. Oh, look at these. This is, I don't know. Some of these street lights look a little weird to me. I think it's more of like, it's all kind of compact here, you know? Yeah, that's what it is. But my game actually doesn't have any uh, stoplights, which is weird. I know. I haven't got around to like making any models for the stoplights, so I kind of just didn't add any yet. So I also need to find out where I'm going to take a screenshot. So we have a few cul-de-sacs here as well. One, two, three. Oh, quite a few. My dog is having a dream right now, and he's, like, wailing in his dream. You know how dogs dream, and then they just start making these, like, small barks? It's like you almost want to wake them up. But that must mean they're dreaming pretty good. Now he's snoring. <laughs> now he's snoring. Oh, my God. He likes to sleep under my bed. My bed lifts up off the ground due to the platform that it's on. And he just, like, hides underneath it. Sleeps there all day. So, there's quite a few neighborhoods. What is that over there? There's something over there we're going to have to check out. Uh, we are going to just drive over these because we do know a train's not coming. And we don't want to have to get stuck again. There's the lot. I do like how all the roads are named. That's good as well. Yeah, no, I definitely didn't do a video on this in the past. I actually don't even know when this game was released. I know the name has been used before, though. And I don't remember if it was this group, but there was a group that had, like, this map that was based out of, like, a desert or something. And I almost want to say it was Desert Ridge. It was, like, based out of, like, I think it was like Arizona or California and it had like a sandy map or something. I don't know if that was this game or not. How do I get over there? My fingers are starting to cramp. Hold on. I have no idea how to get over there. Go right. We'll go right to go left. Hopefully that helps us, right? No? How do we get over there? Get some more blockades. Um... Wait a minute. Kind of just dead ends over there. Hold on. No, it doesn't. It wraps around, but we're going to take this way because I think it might be shorter. Okay, this map's bigger than I thought. A lot bigger than I thought. I thought it was kind of just like a, a few streets, but no. We're going to run some stop signs because, yes. I'm hoping there's like an outer road that takes you back there. Actually, you know what we can do? Let's do this. I should do this with a lot more maps. Do like a whole free cam of everything. Okay, that road down there ends. So I'm thinking there's a road over here that kind of leads you to it. All right? How do you get back there? I see something back there. There's like a whole nother neighborhood or something. Or it's a park. Yeah, there's a road back here. And it's having a hard time loading in. But we're going to get back there. We're going to go right here. If we can. Maybe there's no road leading to it yet. Maybe that part of the map isn't out. Once again, we're going to fly over this. Oh, I didn't even notice the spoiler on this bus. I don't know if that's what you would call it, but... That's what it looks like. Okay, this road does lead to it. Okay, cool. Okay. So you almost kind of have a hard time getting back here because it, it seems like there's only one road that leads to it. 
Oh, that was a wide turn. That was so unnecessary. What do we got here? Scorpion Heights Park. So it's safe to say that this town is the home of the scorpions. This would be a good spot to get a screenshot right here. Uh, let's back up. Hold on. Gotta get that playground in the in the back. There we go. That's gonna make a great thumbnail. Yep. That's the one. Let's see. Or should it be something like that? I kind of like this one. Yeah, I like that one that we took. All right. And then I think it kind of just ends back here, doesn't it? Yeah, you can definitely tell there's going to be some more progression with the road systems. Yeah. I love the fact that they added the barricades. So it's not just some pointless you don't like like you don't know if it's going to be an expansion or not you know now that we know that there's blockades there you know we know that there's construction happening so uh, stop here i didn't see how many schools were there i didn't even notice Let's drive by there one more time because uh, I, I think I only noticed one or two schools and they were kind of in the middle of the map. We had the academy, right? And then we had two other schools that I think were in the middle by the lot or something. I think I saw. We're going to drive by those really quickly. Before, hopefully we don't die on the way. My goodness. I say my goodness a lot, don't I? I definitely do. I used to swear a lot in my videos. I try not to now. Actually, I rarely ever do. But for one, YouTube doesn't like it when you do that anymore. So, uh, And then the second reason is I have a lot of children that apparently watch my videos. So I try to be respectful. Should we just run the light? No. No, we should not. I have to lead by example. This is going to be a long video, isn't it? 22 minutes already, or 23 minutes. All right. We're going to fly over that train track once more. This is the last time, I swear. I just got a message. From who? My car insurance. Got it. Got it. They let me know when a payment's about to come out. All right. Um, let's make a right here. Oh, no. We just, I knew that was going to happen. Personally, I think the mailboxes shouldn't be collidable. One, it kind of reduces lag if they're not. And then two, oh, there's really no need for them to be collidable. All right. Uh, so yeah, I think there's, oh, I thought this was a school. It's not, it's like, uh, an apartment complex perhaps. Yeah. Look at that. I like that sign. That's a great looking sign. My goodness. Yeah. That's a cool sign. And then we have another school here. So I think there's only two, two schools. I could be wrong, but I love the look of this one. This one looks pretty cool. I love that sign, too. And the signs in this game are peak. Okay. I love the parking as well. Got the handicap parking here. Not bad. Not a bad looking school. And it's right next to a lot, not the lot. We'll park in that lot. Why not? Um, Phoenix Bluff High School. Wait, was this the same? Wait, I'm starting to think. 
Is this the same game? Wait, same group as uh, the Phoenix Transportation? No, it's not. It's, it has the same owner, though, doesn't it? I'm going to have to double check on that. I don't want to be wrong. Let me check. Because uh, I think that group had actually shut down as well. I don't even know if I'm still in that group. Uh, let me just double check. I don't think I am. Yeah, no, it's Mooncrest. That's right. It has the same owner. That's right. Okay. Yeah, so we, we've checked out a few of the games that the owner has, you know, released in the past. However, I actually am pretty happy that Deer Valley is opened again because uh, that was a good group, honestly, and they had some good games. I remember, uh, I now that I'm actually remembering, I did a video on their Fairbanks game, I'm pretty sure, a long time ago as well because that was a game I had to buy, I'm pretty sure. In the past, I think, I don't remember. Anyway, uh, if you guys do want to see more uh, videos on the games underneath this group, let me know down below. Um, I always like it when a new game opens up because that's like one more game I can play with subscribers on like live streams and stuff. So um, hopefully this uh, group makes a great return. Uh, like I said, it'll be linked in the description down below if you wish to join. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want to play this game yourself it will be linked in the description down below if you guys like the video please like and subscribe i'll catch you guys next time peace